<laughs> oh, I caught that on camera. Hi guys. So for today's video, I thought I would do a another one of those Q and A's, but this time for YouTube. So I've got some questions on here that I'm just going to answer. And yeah, number one, how did you get your YouTube name? Well, my YouTube name is actually my proper name, so I was born with it. Number two, if you could change your name to anything, what would it be and why? Okay, so as you guys may know, my name is Jordan. That's a guy's name. I don't really like that name. I never have. I don't know what I would change it to though. I'd probably really just swap my first and middle name around. And my middle name's Tori, so that's like the singer Tori Amos. Still, it would be a better name than Jordan. Okay, number three. If you could go back in time and give your younger self advice, what would it be and why? I would probably tell my younger self to not care about what anybody thinks and start your YouTube early because yeah, it's I should have done that. And don't be a little shit. And yeah, I think that's about it. Number four. How old would you when you first learned to blow a bubblegum bubble? I actually remember this really well. I was coming to I was going to Victor Harbour once. I had a chewy in my mouth and mum was just like, oh yeah, you've got a chewy, learn how to blow bubbles. That'll keep you from being bored. So it did take me the whole car ride up there to master them. But yeah, five. What did I want to be when I was little? Well, I used to want to be everything. And when I say everything, I mean everything. I always used to want to be like a chef and an astronaut and a vet and a nurse and a horse rider and a gymnast and a dancer and yeah pretty much everything. Question 6. What do you order at Starbucks? Well in Adelaide we don't actually have a Starbucks. They for some reason all left about 9 years ago but I go to Gloria Jeans because that's the best thing we have and there's a few orders that I like, like I get like a caramel latte or a cappuccino. They're my two favourites from there. Yeah. What's the hardest you've ever loved? It's probably like all those little family events you used to have when you were younger, like with your whole family. I used to be what they called the clown, so I used to just make everybody laugh and then laugh at them laughing. You could play any musical instrument, which would it be and why? I've always wanted to play acoustic guitar or drums to be honest. I love both and I thought that'd be fun to play. What would your favourite thing to do when you're upset? I probably watch YouTube videos and listen to music. Not at the same time of course, that's just hard work. But they're probably my two things that I do. What's your favourite movie? Um, I love anything Disney. I'm not even ashamed to say that. I love anything Disney. What's one food you cannot live without? I'm going to have to say probably chicken. <laughs> it's the only meat I like apart from bacon. So I can't really live without that because I don't want to be a veggie because I don't like veggies. <laughs> so yeah. What's your favourite dessert? Chocolate. Would you rather have a superpower to read minds or the superpower to be invisible? Well, I used to say when I was younger that I already had the superpower to be invisible and that pretty much just stands and I'm in year 12. So that doesn't happen very well. So I would rather have the superpower to read minds so then I'll have both and I can tell what people are thinking about me. What did I do for my last birthday? Well, my last birthday was on a Friday last year. We had exams that day, very funny enough. So my actual birthday I did 
two exams. If he had one personal selfish wish, what would it be and why? What do I classify as selfish? Like, it's like, get yeah, like, uh, I don't know what selfish is. If you were a Pokemon, what would you be called and what would you look like? So, I don't really know the Pokemon at all, but I'm guessing I'll be like the one with the fire tail in black. That would be me. That is it. I am. That's me. That's it. I'm black fire one. Okay, guys. So, that was the end of today's video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. If you comment on it, mean things, I will accept that comment. And please subscribe so you get to see all my horrible videos. Okay, so I hope you have a good week. And I'll see you beautiful faces next week. Bye.